Happy Thursday, stars. I'm Bella. And I'm Cameron. How is everyone doing today? It's September 17th and is an e-week for our special area classes. I hope that you are enjoying your specials this week. I know I am. We have an exciting opportunity for all the AB boys. It's time for, to sign up for the club's Cub Scouts. There will be a meeting tonight in the AVE parking lot at 6.30 to get more information. We have a thoughtful Thursday quote for you that is an Islamic proverb. It says, a lot of different flowers make a bouquet. If you, have, if you have a bouquet, the more different kinds of flowers there are, the better it looks. So it doesn't matter if you are different than others. If everyone was the same, the world would be so boring. Today is National Constitution Day. 233 years ago, on September 17, 1787, the Constitution of our country was signed. It created our government, the basic laws, and the fundamental rights for the U.S. citizens. It was signed by our founding fathers, Benjamin Franklin, George Washington, James Madison, and Alexander Hamilton. James Madison is the one who wrote most of it. The Constitution has a special section called the Bill of Rights. It gives Americans the right to practice different religions, have free freedom, and more. Now let's recognize our school leaders. It's time for Leadership Lookout. Cameron in Deke Marshall's class was caught modeling habit one, be proactive. Cameron is proactive by always following directions the first time they are given. Axel in Roman in Knox Looper's class was caught modeling habit six. Axel and Roman work as a great team to help Miss Shreebing by delivering book baskets every day. Keep, Keep on shining stars. We have two birthday stars today. Let's all wish a happy birthday to Annabelle Barnes and Layla Davis Wilson. Have, have a, a great, great birthday. birthday. Our lunch options for today include walking tacos or a regular or spicy chicken patty sandwich. Our sides will be refried beans, a relish tray, or fresh veggies. We have a joke from Addie in Mrs. Faust's class. What do you say when you step on a dead ant? I don't know. What? Dead ant. Dead ant. Dead ant. Dead ant. Dead ant. Do you have a joke that you really want to hear on the show? Then write it down neatly with your name and your teacher's name on it. Then put it in the joke box outside the media center. Or if you are doing online school, you can send them in to abtvjokes at gmail.com. That is it for us. Today, we have Mrs. Hardin's virtual students here to lead the pledge. Wait, how does that work? Let's find out. Over, Over to you, you, virtual stars. Morning, we have boys and girls from Mrs. Hardin's virtual class joining us to lead the pledge. We have Sawyer, smile and wave, Sawyer, and Cadence, and Shelby, Devante, and Alex. Thank you for being our pledge leaders this morning. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.
down on paper and called it the Constitution. And it's been helping us run our country ever since then. The first part of the Constitution is called the Preamble and tells what those founding fathers set out to do. We the people, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility. Do ordain and establish this constitution. 